What is happening, YouTube? Obi-Wan Kenobi episode three is here. And my God, this show keeps getting better and better. Shout out to little girl Leia because I love her more and more as these episodes go on. I didn't, I didn't think I would care about little girl Leia in this series, but yo, she has completely won me over. She's adorable. She's weedy. She, she's, she, she's awesome, yo. I love it. But the man, the Dark Lord, Darth Vader, is so badass in this series. The lightsaber fight that him and Obi-Wan Kenobi have been destined to have in this series was, was pretty good. What I liked about it the most was what I got from the fight is Darth Vader, he was toying with Obi-Wan. Mind you, Obi-Wan, he, he hasn't been using the Force. He's been out of practice for 10 years. Darth Vader, he's been getting stronger in the Force for 10 years. And just to see him toy with Obi-Wan Kenobi and watch Obi-Wan watch Obi Kenobi Run away. He know he can't take uh, 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 Darth Vader. He know he ain't the man he used to be. Hell, he said in the last, uh, in the first episode, I'm not the man I used to be. How, how cool is that line, by the way? I'm not the man I used to be. You're going to have to be. One more fight. That was so dope. That was the first episode. But in this episode, you see it. He's not the man he used to be. You know, and just seeing how Ewan McGregor played, he's, Ewan McGregor is really dope at the at these very like he, he he has these panic attacks when he senses Darth Vader in the Force. You know, it, there's this one scene where Darth Vader is he comes to this town and he just starts wiping out the locals. What I got from it is he was trying to draw Obi-Wan out because like they said, the Jedi hunt themselves. You know, it's in the Jedi to want to help people. So what I got from that is he was killing these people because he was trying to draw Obi-Wan out because he knew Obi-Wan was wanting to help him, these people. You know? And, man, what have you become? I am what you made me. Or whatever uh, Darth Vader said. Darth Vader, his presence is very dope in this movie, y'all. I, I really dig his presence in this movie. Reva. Reva. I, I, I dug her a lot more in this episode. Reason is, is because you... I, I, I got her motivation. What does she want, right? She wants to go up in the ranks, right? She wants to be Grand Inquisitor, right? She's power hungry. And I'm finally glad I got to see her motivation. And the way she acted her role in this episode was... uh. It wasn't as just one noted as it was in the first two episodes. You know what I'm saying? There, you you got some 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 glimpses of uh, 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 as Robert Meyer Burnett would say. Shout out to him and John Kennedy show versimilitude. You know, <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, this episode was really entertaining from beginning to end. Right, seeing Obi Wan, the the scene where him and Leia are in that in the back of that shuttle with the stormtroopers. My damn, my light just went out. Him in the back of the shuttle with those stormtroopers, just and almost getting caught. Well, he did get caught at the end, but I felt that was a really good scene. Seeing Hayden Christensen in this episode. 
as you know Annika Skywalker was really dope even though it was just a uh, what do you call those things a hallucination right it was really it was really good to see uh Hayden Christian back as Annika Skywalker but guys Obi-Wan Kenobi just keeps getting better and better you know hell freaking Ewan McGregor at Star Wars Celebration I don't know if he was just joking but he said hell that probably could be about 10 episodes right now it's scheduled for six but shoot you know I hope they go over 10 episodes hell because this show this series is actually really really good you know what I'm saying I didn't think it was gonna suck you know and I, I'm really enjoying what I'm seeing guys I'm really enjoying what I'm seeing and guys I, I hope everyone out there is enjoying obi-wan as much as i am right but guys those are just my thoughts i just wanted to get out here and just talk about it because i've already watched the episode like three times and man i think this is by far my favorite episode right and you know but, but when i was when, when they announced the obi-wan kenobi series I was wondering, I, I knew there was going to be lightsaber fights. Of course, you got you can't have an Obi-Wan Kenobi series without a lightsaber fight. But I was wondering, how, in, in what style is the Obi-Wan Kenobi, excuse me, in what style is the, the lightsaber fights going to be? Is it going to be like the prequels? Is it going to be like really, like, like a dance, really prettied up, you know? Or is it going to be like the sequel trilogy and the you know, the original trilogy where it's not as clean, it's more realistic, you know? And it was more, it, it was more of the level of the sequel trilogy and the, you know, the, the original trilogy. And I thought that was cool, right? But guys, check this episode out, please. It's so good, all right? And uh, I can't wait for episode four. I pray to God that we get more than six episodes please god please give us more than six episodes because i'm enjoying obi-wan kenobi so much right i gotta get a hot toys Darth Vader, god especially after seeing this obi-wan kenobi fight right but guys those are just my thoughts i really enjoyed this episode post your comments in the comment section below let me know what you thought of this episode and until the next video peace i'm gone